In this edit, I'm going to show you how to use the blending mode to change the deepness of the sky. First, select the sky by using the selection control point. Grab the plus selection control point, placing it on the sky itself. Drag it over to the right. Right click, duplicate. Put another one in the middle. Right click, duplicate. Put a third one on the edge. We need to select the lower part of the sky as well. Right click, duplicate. Drag it down. Right click, duplicate. Drag it over to the left. Now, one more right in the middle. Right click, duplicate. With the sky selected, we need to protect from the clouds being changed as well. To do that, grab the minus selection control point. Click it on the sky. Right click, duplicate. Click on the sky. Duplicate. One more down on the very bottom part of the clouds down here. Let's increase this control point a little bit more, spread it out. Now we go selection. This time choose select adjustment. Go to light, levels and curves. We're not going to adjust the levels and curves palette. We're actually going to go down to the opacity option. Click on opacity. Go with the blending mode, which is located under the channels option. Blending mode is set at normal, and change that to multiply. By adjusting that, we have now multiplied the sky colors that were being selected with the selection control points, giving us a deeper, richer blue, and maintaining that smooth transition that we normally shot, just like using a circular polarizer. Thank you for your time. My name is Terrence Campbell. Have a wonderful day.